Hello, I'm going to talk a little bit louder. I hope you can hear me. So I'm Madonna, and I'm a licensed clinical mental health counselor, and this is Hank, and he is a licensed clinical mental health counselor. Hank has had Lewy body dementia for approximately 10 years. So today what we're going to do is we're going to show you, it's uh, a little less than four minutes, it's a video from 2017, uh, and Hank, uh, when he first got sick, I, I mean he'd been sick for a few years at that time, but you'll see that he was in a lot worse shape than he is now. Um, do you remember where you were at when we took this video? We was at our office. Right. In North Carolina. Right. Was at our office in North Carolina. Do you remember that day when we took this video, or do you not remember it? I remember it, but I think a lot of details didn't stick, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I, I do remember the, you know, the, the gist of everything. Do you remember that right before the video, you had just taken a nap and woke up? Yeah. Okay. And I guess I thought that was part of, you know, me being tired and stuff, but okay. it led to something else, didn't it? Yeah, I don't, I didn't know really what was going on. I mean, you got up and you, because we had like six offices at our office, so there was a couch in all them because we were counselors, so Hank had plenty of places to sleep, and, and you had been asleep, and, uh, and when you came into the front office and sat down, we just began to talk and I just couldn't get over how, I mean, it looked like somebody that had just gotten drunk with alcohol. And I knew that wasn't the case because you'd been at the office and you didn't drink like that anyway. Mm -hmm. uh, but then you couldn't uh, figure out how to put your wallet up. Uh, it, you'll just see whenever you watch the video. And then after the video, we'll come back and talk a little bit. Do you have anything else you want to tell them about the video? Or? No, I think... Uh... I think maybe when it gets going, I'll have more. Okay. Okay. So we'll see you back in just a little bit. I want you to go home to do nothing. What do you think? Huh? I've got a pretty good job doing that here. Taking my picture. I was, yeah, I was videotaping you. So when we go to the doctors. They don't want to see video of me. Why? That's stuff that you do with family. That's stuff you do with family? Do you want to go home? I don't know what I do. Nothing. How about you go into an office and do nothing? You want to just go in an office and lay down? Like that was just done? Yeah, but I think you need to do it some more. You seem like you need some more sleep. What do you think? Don't you think? Don't you think you need some more sleep? I don't know. I woke up. Maybe you could go back in there and lay in the chair and take another nap? And maybe tomorrow you can do the post office and stuff. We'll just see how you feel. But you said you did the post office. I did two of them, yeah. But we still got to do another one. The box. Good, yeah. The P.O. box, right. How do you feel? Is your ears ringing? Yeah, but not as loud as sometimes. Okay. And you still feel real tired? Uh, a little bit. Not, not as bad as I did, I think, yesterday. You look tired. Yeah, I think you ought to just go back and take a nap. Okay. What do I do with this? Oh, it's my. What is it? It's my wallet. Okay. 
And what do you need to do with it? Okay. Did you forget what you're doing? Mm -hmm. What were you doing? I was working savings for a motorcycle. What about your billfold? It's going in my wallet. Your billfold's going in your wallet? I mean, in my pocket. Well, seems like you're walking pretty good. Yeah, I'm walking. Okay. Okay, so we hope you guys liked the video. The main reason that we're showing that is so you can see how people go through different things. And how at that time, Hank was really severe that day. And you could tell in my voice, I didn't laugh about anything when he couldn't figure something out. Now I look at the video and I think, that was pretty funny. But I didn't laugh then because I was so sad. And it was so, to me it was traumatic to watch those things happen with Hank. Uh, and it was just the childlike look on his face and the innocence. And, and you know, you can picture it as a child and it, it was funny, but it wasn't a child to me. I mean, he's my husband. I also wanted to say that we talked about, me and Jessica talked a lot about that when you would be really severe. You know, you had a look that reminded us of Michael J. Fox. Mm. And it was just your facial expressions because you just would have like a flat affect. You just didn't have any emotions and stuff. And I could see just something about it. You could just see that you, you looked like that. And plus you looked a lot different back then because you didn't have a beard. Yeah. Is that what you've done? Grown a beard trying to be somebody else? Are you yeah, an imposter? I'm a superhero. Oh, a superhero. Mm -hmm. What would be your power if you were a superhero? Uh, cure dementia. Cure dementia. Very good. So we hope you guys like the video and, and please comment and uh, I'll look and see if I have any other kind of videos but I don't make a lot of videos like that so I just I didn't have I didn't record a lot of things I can only tell you about what happened so if you have any questions or comments let us know please reply please subscribe uh, hit the like button and hit the notification so you know when we put out our next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.